Hi there, Spark fans. Rob Reynolds here. With more people staying home or working from home, we've been seeing reports about improved air quality around the world, particularly above larger cities. But what about the air quality in your home? Have you been wondering how that's doing? Well, now you can find out exactly how the air in your place is doing with the new SparkFun Quick SGP air quality sensor. This breakout board uses the Sensirion SGP30, a tiny multi-pixel gas sensor designed for high precision indoor air quality applications. This sensor outputs equivalent CO2 readings from 400 to 60,000 parts per million and total volatile organic compounds, or TVOC, from 0 to 60,000 parts per billion. It also allows you to access its raw measurement values for ethanol from 0 to 1,000 parts per million and H2, or hydrogen gas, from 0 to 1,000 parts per million. It uses the I2C interface through a pair of onboard quick connectors and draws about 48.2 milliamps during measurement mode and as little as two microamps in sleep mode. If you've worked with air quality sensors before, then you know that they can require a burn-in time of up to 48 hours, plus an additional run-in time of another 20 minutes before you can even get your first reading. Not so with this little beauty. 15 seconds and you are up and running. I have a setup pretty much exactly like this one on my desk at home, just to make sure I'm not snorting too much CO2 or TVOCs. So there it is. If you want to keep an eye on the air quality in your home, head over to SparkFun.com and pick up your own SparkFun Quick SGP30 air quality sensor. And remember, stay safe, be kind, and happy hacking. Now you can find out exactly how the air in your home, uh, uh, so close. Uh, really wrong, wrong, right. <laughs> Coding, fine, build, fine. Plugging in, that's where I stumble. I'm just to make sure I'm not smorting, smorting? <laughs> What's a smort? Just to make sure I'm not snorting, snorting. Wow, snorting is a tough word for me. <sighs> I know, I got excited. I was like, I'm at the end, I should sprint. Make sure I'm not smorting, wow. Apparently I have been smorting too much CO2, TVOX, and whatever other fumes are coming off my PLA and ABS. And remember, stay safe, be kind, and happy hacking. That's what I'm going to say.